hello, hello, hello. Time yes to roll. Welcome, 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 baby. Come on in and have a seat. We're going to jump straight into this read. See what message the Spirit has for you guys today. So you need to know for your greatest and highest good at this time. What is the message for the collective? I'm going to shuffle. Thank you. In the name of the Mother, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. What is going on? What is the collective need to know right now for the greatest and highest good? First card out. Spirit says, stand in your power, babies. Okay? There may be some things you may need to let burn. Let that shit burn, okay? And stand in your power. Release what needs to be released. What does the collective need to know? And stand in your power because there's somebody knee-high private eye on social media mad at your glow-up, honeys. So you keep doing you. They stand in the background. They mad. They're angry. What else does the collective need to know right now? For the greatest and highest good. Yeah, because you out here getting that bag. <laughs> You out here growing the fuck up. You got that money, that paper, that abundance coming in. And you're standing in your power and they're mad. Spirit says you may need to journal. Okay? Start writing your goals, desires, and dreams. The picture of yourself is awesome now. Write the lifestyle you want and write daily. Write about what you want. Continue to stand in your power. Continue to manifest here. What else does the collective need to know? Yep. Spirit says, because you are becoming who you are, babies. You are happy. You're successful. You're healthy. You attract abundance. You got a great body. You deserve good things. Life is beautiful. You are confident. You're courageous. You're financially abundant. You have the guidance from the divine and from your ancestors. And this is why you're standing in your power. You are balanced. You're whole. And you're doing the damn thing here, collective. Tell me more. Yeah. You're relaxing. It's all about you, babies. Okay? There may be some people or places or things that you may miss sometimes, but you don't miss the pay that they gave you. And the same motherfuckers that you walked away from, that you cut out, these are the people that are standing in the background, high, knee-high private eye on social media, mad that you're glowing up, mad that they missed out on you. Mad because they didn't take that chance with you. Or they fucked off the chance they had with you. Yeah, you went on. Okay? <laughs> They're mad because life goes on and you went on. You just moved on about your business. You started focusing on you. Focusing on your paper here. Right? And you're receiving justice. You're receiving justice here. And if you're not, then this is what you need to be doing, collective. You need to be standing in your power. Becoming who you are so that you can call in this abundance. Release the things that no longer serve you. Move forward so that you can have justice. Write out the manifestations that you want. And stop worrying about these motherfuckers in the background that's fucking um, hating on your glow up. Yeah, look. You hopscotch right onto some shit. Ain't nobody got time for bullshit. Hop try to new things. Yeah, you stood in your power. You walked away from the bullshit. You ain't got time for that. You know exactly who you were. You know your worth. Okay? And you walked away from whoever these, these motherfuckers is. And yeah, you may miss them. But you ain't got time for the pain and the bullshit. You focused on your check. You focused on that bread. You focused on your paper. And this motherfucker mad. This could be your ex. Mad. This could be friends, family. Mad. Because you're not focusing on it. Because you know life goes on. You know karma will be served. And you're not tripping. Yeah, you, you got workplace excellence going on out here. You you are getting to the motherfucking bag. And if you're not, you fence to. Life goes on, keep moving. Focus on you, loving on you, becoming who you are. Because you good at what you do. And it's going to bring you that bag. And motherfuckers go hate. Spirit says you may need to clean your space. Sage. Palo Santo crystals. Okay? Cleanse your energy. Release these things that no longer serve you. And keep focusing on your money. Keep focusing on your bag. Keep doing you. Yeah, because somebody sent you some motherfucking type of spiritual attacks. So they want you to cleanse your space. Sage, y'all. Palo Santo crystals. Be protected. Extra protection. 
Because somebody, you're recovering from a spiritual attack. Somebody took a spiritual attack towards you. But you are recovering. Anything they try to send towards you is not working. It keeps bouncing back right on them. You just keep cleansing your space and you keep focusing on your money. You keep moving forward. And everything they send will be reversed and sent back to them. Or you can transmute it into more abundance for you. Anything else the collective needs to know right now. So if your money had been funny or whatever, these motherfuckers is watching. It slowed down a little bit or something like that. That's because these motherfuckers were sending negative energy towards you. And I feel like it's more than one person. Yeah, but they're watching. They're watching. They're watching to see if this magic worked, but it didn't. They ain't stopped nothing or slowed nothing down. Your money is still abundant. Yeah, they're mad because you said goodbye to the drama or anything that did not serve you. And they're mad because you focused on your motherfucking goals. Keep doing you, baby, because you got workplace excellence here. Write the life you want and then manifest it. The money is here. You have it all right before you. Spirit says, let the stress go of the hustle. Oh, it says, no, let the stress of the hustle go for now. Reflect on you. Have quiet time. Get out and go enjoy some nature. Okay? Go get grounded and come back brand new, ready. Hop a trot away from the bullshit. Whoever you walked away from, whoever you let go, they're going to watch you succeed here. Yeah, they're a success hater. And they're mad because your wealth is growing and they can't stop it. Nothing they do is stopping it. They cannot stop your wealth from growing, babies. You are career-minded. You're focused on your goals. <laughs> and your career or your business is leveling up at this time. Level up, baby. Elevating your mindset, learning and uplifting yourself. Whoever these people are that these success haters, they betrayed you. They betrayed you. And they're mad because you walked away because you knew you had more to offer than just your body. You knew your worth. And you walked away from this purpose, from, from this person, from these people. Because you knew your worth. And you started focusing on your money. You refused to stay in something where somebody was betraying you. And now they're mad. But Spirit says, tell your haters you said fuck them. You could have said fuck this person. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. And walked on about your business. And you still leveling up. Watch me level up. This, these people are watching you from the background now. Mad because your success and wealth is growing. And everything they keep trying to send towards you. All this magic. All this negative energy. All these evil eyes. All that shit keeps backfiring and going back to them. They could be doing mirror magic. But that shit is going right back to them. Because you still out here being a lady or a man boss. Adjusting, adjusting your motherfucking crown. And you out here steadily manifesting. They can't stop it. They can't stop it. They can't stop you, baby. A batteram. You coming through like a batteram. Okay? That just gave my age. But the batteram used to be this thing um, that the police used to ram through your motherfucking door like if you had a drug house back in the days. And, and it would knock your motherfucking doors off the hinges, okay? Fuck up your whole shit. The whole front of your house be fucked up. That's how you coming through. You coming through like a batter ram collective and they mad because you fucking shit up. And you succeeded and you're growing your wealth and it's knocking people on their ass because these same people betrayed you. These same people did you wrong and now they get to sit back and watch you succeed. They get to sit back and watch your manifestations come to life while you get to relax. Okay? Spirit says relax because life can be overwhelming sometimes. Renourish your energy, refresh your spirit. Take some time to yourself and come back, babies. Find a balance. Find a balance. Anything else the collective needs to know right now, spirit, for the greatest and highest spirit. That's it off this deck. Okay. Huh. Spirit says you will do big things. So step out of your comfort zone. Stop doubting your greatness, collective. Stop doubting your greatness. Okay, so I'm going to leave this here. If it resonated with you, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, my loves. All my information is down below. Don't forget to check out the other channels. You can leave donations now, um, either on Cash App or on the website. Just click the link below. 
um, click buy and then scroll down so you see donations and you can leave a donation there. Check out all the products. We have everything from incense to sage, spiritual baths, spiritual candles, um, scenic candles, uh, and some other wonderful, lovely spiritual things over there. Go check that out, babies. Um, I think that's all the business for now. So until next time, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Mwah! Bye, my TT babies.